Welcome back to part two of the Amber Shows. This is a pretty serious uh, story right here. Um, born into suffering. Uh, more babies are arriving um, in this world dependent on drugs. Um, Louisville, Kentucky uh, has one of the largest rates, 48% birth rate. Uh, children are being born on heroin and methadone addictions. Uh, some of the women with the methadone is because once they're finding out they're pregnant, they're trying to get off and they, 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 they take methadone. And then when you take methadone, what happens is um, methadone is worse than heroin. The addiction is worse, the withdrawal is worse, and so it's not helping these poor innocent children at all. Shortly after he was born, um, little Leopold, his name is Leopoldo, Leopoldo Baptista. Uh, his tiny body is suffering from pains of drugs withdrawal. Uh, it's really, really sad. Uh, I saw a video of him. Um, his mother uh, being, is being treated with methadone uh, for heroin addiction, and she passed the drugs into his system, of course. He's a 10-day-old baby going through withdrawal. Uh, it's becoming way more common. Uh, the rate is highest in Tennessee, Mississippi, Alabama, and Kentucky. Kentucky, the hardest hit, as I told you, 48% of newborns are drug addictive. Uh, they cry uh, piercingly, uh, they vomit, they have diarrhea, high fevers, respiratory problems, seizures. Uh, they are extra, they're extra sensitive to light, so when they're in I, uh, ICS, uh, they have to be moved to dark and quiet areas. Uh, they need to be cuddled and rocked and kept calm. So the methadone is as bad or worse as the heroin. Um, it's, it's a really sad, sad situation that's going on uh, with that. I don't understand um, why we can't find something else uh, or why are people still doing drugs like heroin and, and, and things like that. I mean, it's just 2015. Heroin is only going to bring you down. There's nothing, 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 nothing that comes once you take your first hit of heroin. Nothing. Nothing comes from it, except maybe if you like it, then your life is just one life of destruction. So, I really hate hearing that. Uh, Donald Trump said he will win the Latino vote. Now, you know he's funny, right? How is Donald Trump going to win the Latino vote the way he talked about Mexicans? He said they're, uh, we're bringing them in this country and they're raping people and they're selling drugs and they're killing people and robbing people. But he says that they work for him all his construction sites or they work for him in uh, matters of uh, in the kitchens and uh, in his restaurants and things like that but yet he said that about them so um, his reason for saying that they will still vote for him he said that he has lots of Mexicans working for him and that they love him you think they really love you Donald uh, they need a paycheck um, he said he creates jobs for legal Mexicans, he put that in quotes, and he said that you can bet for sure that Hillary nor Jeb will ever, ever uh, hire Mexicans and help the job market with legal Mexicans. Donald Trump, I don't know, he's just as, maybe he has dementia, kind of sounds like it. All right, you guys, that was part two of the show. I just wanted to get back to you and finish up. You guys have a wonderful day, a happy over the hump day. And I'll see you either later on tonight if I get some juicy information or we'll talk tomorrow. Have a great day. Thank you for coming to the Amber Shows. And don't forget, I need a thumbs up. Thank you. Mm -hmm.